Hello guys, what's up? My name is Israel and today I have a special video for you. I am going to be showing you one of my favorite cities in my home country, Mexico. The city is called Santiago de Querétaro and is very near my hometown, so I've been here quite a few times and it's definitely one of my favorite cities in Mexico. So I'm very excited to show it to you. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy it. Alright, so Querétaro is located right in between San Miguel de Allende and Mexico City. So in this trip, I was going to San Miguel and I decided to stop in Querétaro for three days. I've always loved Querétaro because it's very safe, it's beautiful, it has good food and the climate is very nice. It's very similar to Mexico City, you know, it's always very mild, it's never too hot, never too cold and yeah it's just a great place to just stop and relax one of the reasons why i love this city is because accommodation is pretty inexpensive i stayed in this airbnb and it cost me 16 dollars per night and as you can see it's very nice pretty spacious and it was located right in the heart of the historic center. So every city in Mexico has a Zócalo or a main square. This would be the main square of Querétaro and it's called Jardín Cenea, also known as Jardín Obregón. And if you like street food like I do, you know, esquites, elotes, helado, this is the place to come. This is one of my favorite streets in the historic center, it's called Cinco de Mayo and this is the place to go if you want to find souvenirs, Mexican candies or if you're gonna eat in a good restaurant. This one was definitely my favorite restaurant, it's called Divino, it's an Italian restaurant. Yes, I know I should be recommending Mexican food but this place was so so good. Walking around Querétaro, sometimes you feel like you go back in time and actually in 1996 the historic center of Querétaro was declared a World Heritage Site by the UNESCO. This is one of my favorite buildings in the city. I was walking by and I discovered it by accident. I was like, wow, what's in there? and it's called La Casa de la Marquesa. It was built in 1756. It has so many details. It looks good on camera, but in real life, it looks so much better. This city is known for its arches, the Acueducto de Querétaro, which was built between 1726 and 1735. It has 74 arches and the best place to see it is called Mirador de los Arcos, which has a really nice view of the city. This is basically the center of the city. It's called Plaza de Armas and the government palace is located here. It used to be called Casa de la Corregidora and this is the place where the Mexican independence got started. This city is perfect for solo travelers because it's very safe. It's considered actually one of the safest and wealthiest cities in Mexico. It has a very vibrant art scene. The food there, as I mentioned before, is amazing and the people are super friendly. Alright guys, so this is it. I know it's a short video, but it was a very short trip for me. But I will definitely be back to Querétaro because I loved it so much. So I'd like to know, have you ever been here? Have you ever heard about Querétaro? I'd love to know. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Take care and stay healthy.